Well, congratulations. And uh, I know this has been asked many times before, but how did it feel as a rookie to step out on the mound in the ninth inning with a no-hitter? Jim, I was quite elated. It's, uh, I think right now, once I think about it, it's more shocking than it is anything. Uh, I can't imagine any rookie doing it uh, as early as I did in my career. Uh, I just hope that uh, I can be a successful pitcher from now on. But what is the knuckle curve, and uh, what does it do to an opposing batter? I don't know specifically what it does to an opposing batter. You'd have to ask them. Uh, yeah, I try to put a forward rotation on the ball. I get a, try to get a curveball spin to it, and uh, it breaks down. Uh, I try to get it to break sharply down. Sometimes it may uh, break down and into a left-hander. Sometimes it may break down and into a right-hander. Uh, but uh, the main thing is to get it to break down as sharp as I can. Uh, not many batters have seen that ball before. Uh, do you think it's a major innovation in pitching style? It may be. Uh, I've had quite a few people wanting to know how to throw it, uh, <laughs> including yourself. Uh, but uh, I think it might be. It's, it's, I don't think it's that hard to throw. It just takes time to, to learn it like it would take time to learn any pitch. And as long as it's hard to hit, it might be popular among pitchers. Uh, right. It's, uh, it's a good pitch. It's my money pitch. It's gotten me where I am now.